Hey guys. Hey guys, it's Ben. Uh, welcome back to Hexen. Um, just before we start Hexen DD, I want to I want to get into the secret levels. First of all, you can jump over down here, which is pretty cool because you can get this. Um, I have been using cheat codes. I'm sorry to clear out all the enemies and unlock sections so that I can reach the areas, but I'm not going to be using cheats to do the sections now. Now, so that, this is the end of the level, or this is the end of the hub. It should take us to the end, right? Okay, now I know someone's going to tell me off here, but... I am using this. In case, that door should be open, so... Also, this should be open as well, shouldn't it? Hush. We know that this would be open, right? There you go. That is how you get it. Okay? Also, why am I still flying? Nope. Huh. Strange. I'm still flying. Oh. Nope, it's wearing off, isn't it? No, I just glitched the thing. Okay. Wait, wait, this is... This is, uh... The Bright Crucible. This is actually a secret map. You know how I was noting, hmm, why isn't, why am I not get reaching the... Hush, that wasn't on for a second there. It's even got some pretty cool music, but, hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it, yeah, okay. Okay, I'm not invincible, I can jump, I'm not clipping through walls, okay. Agreed on that. Now this map is kind of tricky, mainly because first of all, there's tons of stuff attacking us straight off. Uh, second of all, there's those guys. I'm gonna jump down and actually try and take the fight to them. As you can tell, yeah, the map really consists of just a lot of these guys. Now we we don't have all the weapons right now. In fact, we've only got this one, so we've got to rely heavily on this one. But should be possible. Um, so yeah, that's how you get to there. You gotta try and jam yourself in that wall there. Getting all crap. Yeah, good. Um, go down here. Oh, crap, that, that guy. And I don't have to have a weapon, dang it! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, that's it, I'm just doing it like this. Because these, these aren't the guys that shoot at me, so I'm okay doing this all the time, you know. There you go. Get some mana. I've got my ammo. Fire, 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 See, I've never played these secret levels before. Probably never, ever played any of these secret levels. But hey, that's what you get. Whoop, why am I going the options? Uh, secret one. Yeah. That was pretty cool. Hmm. Hmm. Cannot use this here. Okay. Ouch. I think I just gotta jump in. There you go. Now if I have to... I'm gonna go over here. So I hate these guys. All of those guys. Also, is there a... That's a swamp. There's gonna be swamp guys. <laughs> That's great. I love swamp guys. I don't know what the difference between the brown lizards and the green ones are. I think uh, attacks probably deal more damage or something. Also, yeah, I picked up some potions as well, but technically I should be more disadvantaged because I don't have all the weapons on me. Plus, yeah, the secret levels don't really have anything to do with the main levels. Oh, with the hub even. They're just kind of there. Okay, I'm gonna jump over the center there. Now, these guys shouldn't fire projectiles at me, right? 
yeah, they should just exist. Does he, did he actually get caught behind the stairs? That's kind of odd. Okay, so there's nothing there. So if I got, oh gosh, oh gosh, wasn't expecting that, wasn't expecting that. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, panic, panic, panic. Whew. Wasn't expecting that. Thank you very much. I, I really thought I got I got all those guys out of the way. Anyway, so if we go over here now, there'd probably be a similar puzzle over up here. Hmm. Okay. Oh no, it's just these guys. Okay. I don't know why the wing symbol is still in the corner. How about we just ignore that, right? Yeah. Just ignore it. <laughs> yeah. So you may be going, oh, why'd you hack it in? Well, well, like, first of all, if I jump straight into the level, I'm not going to have any weapons or items or whatever. So I'm going to be completely disadvantaged. Second of all, if I, um, I mean, hack in just straight to the level. So I, I went to the hub, went around, picked up some stuff, and then that was it. So I'm also going to do that for the next hub. I'm going to travel over. Or I'm going to kind of hack my way over into there. But just by clipping through walls, killing all the enemies. It's a very nice command that he just kills all the enemies. What the heck? It's not a class lock. Because I'm not Is the door not smashing? Oh, dude. Oh, thank goodness. Ah! Now's not the time to die. Eh. What was the point of that? I'm guessing something would ac activate because of that. Maybe like... Oh gosh! Oh, I've been in the freaking water. Oh gosh. Those freaking guys. Those guys. Oh, this staircase came up. No, oh, that was always there. That was always there. I'm guessing there's a guy over here as well. Yep. Right there. There you go. Oh, they come out. There you go. I know how to take him out. Just use a little boom, bam, and babazzle. Now the big question is, where do I go now? I swear that staircase wasn't elevated before, so... I swear this wasn't here. Oh god, there's a lot of guys. It really didn't look like the projectiles were coming from over here. For a second. Well, actually, I'm almost done with this secret map. It's a pretty cool secret map. I think I'll do two for the first one and then three for the second one because I want to get them all done in nicely uh, in parts. So two two bonus maps for the first for the first part, and I'm, I, I feel like I got to do the yeah, Jones here. And oh, what's we'll going on there? The secret one. There you go. Nope. I thought I had to do anything. Yeah, There's a lot of s pillars here. Look at that polygon count go up. People's computers must have been lagging at at the seams. This one. Um. Yeah. Two two levels for this part and three levels for the for the next part. Just for random bonus stuff. I don't really do bonus parts that much. But hey. Oh. Oh gosh. Got him. So I guess that was it. So I guess that was it. And then that just drops you back here, so yeah. Okay. I'll see you kids when we when we set the next hidden level. Okay. Okay, so once you've opened all of them and you've killed the end boss. Go back to all the way.
way back. It's uh here. Oh. Oh. There you go. It's kind of steep, but eventually you'll be able to find this, which is the sacred grove. Now, this was a place in Twilight Princess, but and also it's got weird rules. Um, other than that, though, it's basically just this. So I'm serious. The, the, the larger the arrow is, the smaller the stage. When you look at the map, it's a scale over like that. So, yeah, that's basically about it. Should I. I didn't have that. I didn't have my headset up the entire time. I'm sorry. That's why it sounded funny. Whoa, jeez. Forsaken outpost. Ah, yeah. Now that's a clue to for something in episode four in the fourth hub. That basically means you have to do the secret in the fourth hub. Well, actually, no. Well, yeah. It's not much of a secret itself, but once you, if you can do the fourth secret as well, then yeah, that's good. If you, by the way, if you don't do this, you can't do the fourth secret. So other than that, pretty much just beat the thing. Okay. See you guys. Actually, you know what? I'll do the next one as well. I'll do the one, next one as well. I'll see you guys then. Pop! Oh. Hey guys, it's Ben. Uh, welcome back to Hexen. And I'm gonna turn. Oh. <laughs> it's like pause the game. <gasps> but. In doing this, I will do the kill monsters just because I wanna show this off. Okay, so firstly, firstly, you gotta kill the guy first, then you gotta, good question actually, alright, Magic pillars, dude. Ouch. Anyway, we're in Deathwind Chapel. That's how you get there. You gotta kind of use the thing I was. Also, game file save. Secret 3. And we have this weapon back, which is all good. Although the last secret was a little bit disappointing, but hey gonna do I think I actually have you have been in the secret to be honest I think I yeah I definitely have been here before huh it's kind of weird why I didn't go into it this LP my regular go it's kind of odd okay so, what am I doing exactly well? That is a good question, I don't even know. Um... Oh. Pull the switch, of course. And now I'll open the thing up in the middle, right? Yeah. Uh, it's kinda weird why these guys actually talk, like they'll say, Weird lines are like something. No, get me back up there. There you go, thank you very much. But other than that, they'll just take you up here. Again. Which is, but that's good, because I can get some more mana. This guy's new. This guy's new. That guy's new. 
that's a new platform thinger. That's a new light switch. And I guess I just how do you, how do you, how do you, how do you get back? How how oh just push the face. Yeah, that takes back, right? Yeah. It's a bit of an intriguing level, to be honest. It's apparently a chapel. I totally see that, apparently. No, I don't. I don't see how it's a chapel. How is this a chapel? Because it's got the, the basement area. It makes it a chapel, apparently. Also, yeah, these are the guys who we're going to shoot, because we're up to that part again. I miss the guys who couldn't shoot. Yo, know, my friends. Also, this music. Interesting. Anyway, pull the flick. And we're back in this room. We were able to pull that. So basically, yeah, that was just one side. Basically, basically, you just got a lot of little areas you gotta do. It's kind of weird side thingies. Ooh. Oh. Oh gosh, all oh, the humanity! They're not humans, aren't they? No, they're not. Huh. How, how will you get around these? And also, that is pretty cool. I think he's just gonna take it slowly, I guess. Hey, you go, got a firestorm again. Ouch! My backside. I'll just use one. May as well. Dude, are they spawning enemies? That's that's a slack way of giving me more enemies. That's a slack way of using the firestorm more. Ugh. I think after when I do all this, I'm gonna order a pizza. It'll be nice, nice and warm, warm pizza. So yeah, it's kind of interesting why they put in secret maps in a game where you can't like it's not even a bit of an arcadey game. It's it's a really full-fledged adventure experience. So I don't know why they were throwing secret maps. I think it's just because secret map. Why wouldn't you? That was apparently breaking all the pot, all the pots. Where is that? Out here? Okay, yeah. Bam. That music. Mm. Now I think I gotta go in on the other side. Get onto. The, yeah, there you go. If I flip that, then I'll open the next door, which is good because then I can exit. Kind of. I think that's it, really. According to the map, that's it. See, that's the thing with these secret levels. There's no end to them. You just kind of go in them, do something, and you're out. Okay, so I'll see you guys next. I'll see you kids next time when we'll tackle on the last two secret levels and we're done with Hexen. Although we've got DD to do after, so see you kids then.